Uh, we, we start with uh, Eric first. Okay, Eric? Oh, you know. Oh, okay. <laughs> a very serious question. No, just kidding. Okay, tell All us right. about yourself and the band. Oh, okay, because me. This, okay, the thing is, because I stalk all of you, the three of you, and I saw your video. Your Eric, your list, recent video is amazing. I love the song. You know, I was talking to Inglong and I was mm. like, uh, is like, it a cover song? He said, no, this is a, it's his own song. He's like, wow. Best it's compliment. Beautiful. It's well arranged and it's well played. Mm -hmm. I like that. It's just a very nice melody driven song. So Thanks so much. Things. Yeah. Excellent energy. Excellent vibe. Yeah. All right. So, okay. What, what I mean, what can I say about myself? Uh, I mean, uh, you, you guys gave me a really, you know, um, solid intro there you know i was raised in you know, a fortified with iron maiden instead of just fortified with iron see? so yes fortified with, uh, iron maiden since i was like um 11 years old mm -hmm. uh then i moved on to you know uh, a heavier and more melodic uh, style of music uh, which is uh, known as power metal and uh, one of the my earlier power metal influences is i would credit gamma ray you know as my main influence and of course, um, I'm also very huge into the Japanese metal scene. I was mm. very influenced by X Japan, uh, Galnerius, and of course, you know some elements of uh, progressive music like uh, Dream Theater. And um, yeah, fast forward to like uh, just like um, mm, probably ten years back when I got back into guitar playing. You know, I was um, I got hooked into bands like uh, Dragon Force, Twilight Force, uh, Hammerfall, Blind Guardian. You know, all the um, European and Scandinavian, um, you know, Influence. yeah, you know, the, the, the big players in the metal scene. So, right. yeah, and um, as to my band, um, we are actually a dual female fronted symphonic power metal band. Yeah. So, what it means is that, um, okay, because we have two lead singers in the band, and uh, you know, we just divide you know, the lead singing duties equally between both of the ladies, and also, um, I combine elements of like you know power metal, symphonic metal like uh, Nightwish, you know, Epica and stuff like that, and I, I put it together as a blend uh, with Japanese metal music into my compositions. So yeah, that's um, that's the style of uh, Silent Angel. Yeah, very and, nice. Yeah, you create your own identity, mm -hmm. even yeah, it's, so different different you know styles inside. Yeah, yeah, that's right. It's, I, I take little nuggets of you know um, various genres, and you know, in, and I get inspired by them, and I just you know put them yeah. into my own compositions. Yeah. Uh, what was your big break? Yeah, I think that's this. This is a very important question for all the audience out there because they all aspire to, you know, yeah. to be like you guys. Yeah, I want to be like Edri. Yeah. Go ahead and be fine. <laughs> Okay. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> oh, all right. Uh, so, who like to go first? Uh, I think. Yeah. Uh, yeah, yeah, no, yeah. No. 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 Please. Yeah. Go, Eric. Go. Oh, me. Yeah. All right. All right. Uh, okay. I I wouldn't say that I've really had, had actually got any big break at the moment, but um, probably one of the biggest breaks is being signed on as a black star artist. Yeah. You know, that's yeah, probably yeah. a big. It, that's it, awesome. It's a it's a big break awesome. for me, you know. And thank you, black star. Yeah. <laughs> Cheers to you know CK Music, City Music, and Black Star, and also you know uh, recently along with a black uh, a Black Star endorsement, I've also signed. I'm also signed as a Blacksmith Strings artist as well. Mm -hmm. So yeah, and um, the next upcoming big break would be that my band would is actually we are signing with a major European label um, for the release of our al album next year. Cool. So yeah. Wow. Nice. Yeah, nice so th that's uh, pretty much like uh, of a, uh, as far as a big break goes. But I think you know, Edri and so he'll have a lot bigger breaks than what I have at the moment. So yeah, <laughs> you're being humble, man. <laughs> no, no, it's just a fact, bro. Uh, 